You are required to measure your engine's main bearing bores for size, taper, and out of round. Friction bearings need to be removed and the bores clean. Main bearing caps need to be installed in their correct position and torqued to manufacturer specifications. To determine main bearing bore size, you will need to follow proper dial bore gauge measuring procedures as outlined in the dial bore gauge usage video. Zero the dial bore gauge with a micrometer to the maximum tolerance allowable as stated in the service information. When measuring, be careful to keep the dial bore gauge out of any oil galleries or recesses in the bores. You will take measurements in three separate locations as indicated in the diagram. Stay off the parting line of the cap by 10 to 20 degrees. Record your results. Compare the largest dimension measured against manufacturer specifications for maximum allowable bore size to determine serviceability. To determine out of round, compare the three measurements you just made at locations A, B, and C. Subtract the smallest dimension from the largest dimension to determine out of round. Record your results. To measure taper, you will use your dial bore gauge to compare dimensions from a point at the front edge of the bore against a point at the back edge of the bore, as indicated in the diagram. These comparison measurements should be taken at the same three places indicated in this picture. The largest difference between any two of these measurements is the amount of taper that the bore has. Record your results. Proceed with measuring the next main bearing bore. If any of the main bearing bores measure larger than the maximum allowable size or fail the out of round or taper measurements, the engine block may be repairable at a machine shop by line boring and fitting of oversized main bearings only if allowable by the engine manufacturer.